Hello friends, in this session we will be taking a look at how to update instance data at runtime. So there are two ways to update instance data. One is through the process inspector in the process admin console. Another one is through the REST API. So let's see how it's done in the process inspector. In process inspector you identify the instance and when you expand the data you'll see all the variables and you can change the value there so let's say we'll change it to some value and that's how you update the data for complex types you'll have to expand the complex type and identify the parameter and then update the value so now let's go back to a rest api tester and see how the data is updated there you will identify the rest api section for process data updation, you will go to the process API. To get the current value of the data, you can go to the current state and key in the instance ID, for example, 62. If you scroll down, you will see a section where all the variables are listed out. So the variables are here. The correlation key is 1234567789. So we will be updating the correlation key. You scroll down to update variables, update instance variable, you type in the instance ID, the variable name and the new value for that data 4567890. Now let's go back to the current state and check whether the value has been updated or not. Let's scroll down to the variable area. The correlation key has been updated to the new value. So that's how you update it and if you want to update variables in bulk or complex variables you will use this particular section from the current state and you'll remove the slash from that and then update it using update variables instead of update variable. 